Hi, this is Tommy Hall with MathNook.com and I'm here to give a quick overview on how to play the Geometry Shapes version of our X-Ray Math game. We also have a Decimals version, a Fractions version, an Integers version, a Multiplication version, and a Rounding version. Let's go ahead and take a look at the game and when you first start up the game, this is the menu you'll see. If you click the More Games button, it'll take you to our website. How to Play will show you the instructions, but we're going to go over that, so let's go ahead and close this out. And let's go ahead and click Start, and this will take you to the menu where, it, when you first start out, now you'll only be able to ch choose this first level, but I've completed the first two levels, so I could actually play, go back and play the first two levels, and then play the uh, third level also. Once I complete the third level, then it will unlock the fourth level, and I can complete that. The levels get uh, progressively harder as they have more uh, shapes that you'll have to match. So let's go ahead and take a look at the first level. And it instructions tell you to click on any uh, of the hidden shapes here and then move it through here to reveal what's inside and then place it where it belongs over here. You have triangle, hexagon, pentagon, circle, square, and rectangle. So let's go ahead and choose one of these. Once you choose it, you cannot put it back. There's nothing you can do for that. Um, that's obviously a triangle. If you look down here below the shape that I'm having on the cursor right now, the score is zero, but once I put it on the triangle, give me a thousand points. And if I take that shape, this is a pentagon, but let's go ahead and say it's a circle. And I don't, I don't go ahead and click that, and it took off 750 points, so now my score is 250. Now, I don't have to put it exactly over here. I'm going to put it on the right one. That's a pentagon. I've got the pentagon shape, as you can see. I don't have to put it right on there, just close enough. Let's go ahead and click that. See, it, it clicks right on there. Here's a square, and I'll drop that on there, and you notice my points going up every time I get a correct answer. Rectangle. Hexagon. And this will complete the level by getting the last shape there. At this point, I can uh, submit my score, and this allows you to... My initials are already there, but uh, let's go ahead and put... Uh, TJ, and you can choose your suffix character and submit it, and you'll see my score right there. And you can actually share this out or challenge a friend via an email challenge. Let's go ahead and close that out, and let's go to the next level. And now you notice the amount of shapes you have increased, but it plays the same. We've got a triangle there, put it there. Let's go ahead and let's see where we got here. Trapezoid. Circle. Octagon. Uh, let's see, that's a hexagon. There we go. I didn't see it at first. Okay. Can be tricky. Square. There's Pentagon. There's Oval. And last but not least, Rectangle. And then we can move on to the next level. Well, that's how you play the game. Uh, it's a fun little game. I uh, hope you enjoy uh, playing it, and thanks for watching.